Hey guys and welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to show you how to create a portfolio website with Canva. Amazing. If you guys are new to Guide Infinity, if you could give us a like and a subscribe, that would be awesome. Okay, let's jump into it. So as you can see, we are in canva.com. And what we're going to do is we are going to come up to this search bar here and we're going to type in portfolio website. So just wait for it to load. And what we're going to do is we are going to come down and we're going to click on this one here. Just wait for it to load. Amazing. Okay. So as you can see, it has brought us up lots of amazing different website portfolio templates that we can choose from. So what you want to do is you just want to scroll down and find the one that suits you. So if you guys don't have Canva Pro, what you want to do is you want to press this all filters button. And if you scroll down to the bottom, you'll have an option that says free or pro. Um, and then if you press the free button, then Canva will show you all the templates that are available for free. So I don't have that option because I'm currently on a pro, a pro plan. So, um, that doesn't give me that option, but that is where you would find that option. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to scroll down and then I'm going to pick a template that I like the look of. So I'm going to go for this option here. I think it looks really smart. So what you want to do is you want to give it a click and then you are going to press customize this template. Amazing. Okay. So Canva has now loaded us this template website. As you can see at the bottom, it says page page one of seven. So you know that this template has got seven pages within it. Now you do obviously have the option to duplicate pages, add more pages, take away pages, but this template has the seven and then you can go from there and edit it and make it however you want to. So what we're going to do is you're just sort of going to scroll down and just see, get the vibe of what's happening, what feel is so okay so so you can say welcome to my design portfolio so if you want to change that um that text you can do so you can click on it you can then come up to this box here and then you can go through all the different fonts and find the one that you like i do think canva has an amazing sort of selection of fonts available it's I just love Canva. I think it's so great. It's so simple to use. Um, so if, for example, we wanted to change the color, so we've clicked here and then you can see this little um, color box here. So we can then go through and change it. So if we're wanting something a bit lighter, that's definitely is me is something a little bit um a little bit more lighter than um than the black uh so i'll go for this color and if we wanted to um so obviously this is a picture of chad so if we wanted to add a picture of ourselves if we come over to the left hand side here where it says uploads and then you could add your own so i'm going to bring this picture over here so if you click it and then if you sort of hold it over it then canva pops that picture in which is so simple and so easy to do so that's amazing so welcome to my design so this could be you could be a photographer a videographer a thumbnail designer so whatever you want to put in so chad um given so you can obviously change that to your own name and then you could say graphic designer obviously thumbnail designer videographer um and go from that then work with me today so then as you can then sort of scroll down who is chad so what you do is you would change that to your name um and then if you clicked again on this box then you can change the color so you might want to do the same or then you might want to go slightly different so we might want to go slightly lighter um, but keeping in the sort of same um, same sort of tones there which is awesome if you want to change the text the color you can click on it and then you can come up um, here change it to however you want uh, move it around same with this title as well 
you can change the photo. So if you want to add some more, so these are some of my pictures. So if you were wanting to obviously showcase your photos within your portfolio, what you can do is you can add some. So what if we do, if we upload a load there and then Canva's just loading that amazing. So whilst it's just loading those, we can sort of scroll on down. So got my background. So again, you know, you can change this to however you want. Um, so you've got a page of my art. So this is amazing. This is where you can showcase some of your own designs. Um, and then obviously add in any pictures that you want. So if you wanted to bring this over, there we go. And then hold that over and then amazing and see how quickly that is and already you know we've uploaded our own images and then you can change the again the sort of background if you want to um to sort of match with those colors it's a little bit too light i think but again you know art is subjective and design is subjective so it's completely how you want it to be if you see all these different icons here so if you wanted to say showcase more of your art maybe you're wanting to have a good sort of two or three pages showing your different designs what you can do instead of pressing add page is you can press this duplicate page and then there you go you've got the exact same layout and then you can add more of your designs here to show off um, all the amazing things that you can do when you have then um when you finish that, what you can then do is come up to the top here and press preview. So it is now going to preview your design for you and you can see that you can do it in desktop or you can do it mobile. So what you can do is you can just sort of scroll down, have a preview and then make sure it is looking exactly how you want. You can see we've got our lovely artwork there. We've got that duplicated page that we did and everything is looking good. So you just wanna maybe check as well. Mobile, obviously a lot of us do um, do things on our mobiles. So just make sure it's looking exactly how you want on a mobile device. Once you are happy with that, you can then come up and press publish website and then you need to just fill out um, all these details so you can press free domain so publish to a canva domain and then if you are happy with that then you can press this purple continue button and then you need to choose your subdomain so once you fill that in and you can press continue and then canva will take you through how you can get that published so you can have it hosted for free with canva which is amazing and that that is it guys that is a quick tutorial on how to create a portfolio website with canva i really hope that you guys found this video useful if you could give us a like and a subscribe that would be amazing it really means so so much to us and i will catch you guys in the next one